What's going on guys, Tywin here bringing you a video how to beat Hammerman's HQ level 10 uh, Boom Beach boss number one, the first main boss of Boom Beach, a new game released by Supercell, the makers of Clash of Clans. It's very much like Clash of Clans um, in terms of you have to build up your base and build up your headquarters which is like the town hall, uh, build up your troops and then uh, deploy them against um, other human players and, and the computer players which uh, <clears throat> General Hammerman is your main nemesis um, and that's what the main campaign focuses on and he will steal villages under your control <clears throat> you can take them back and get gold and also take out their headquarters which is this which is right here it's the first one we're gonna unload heavies and bazookas all to the same spot there shoot some missiles at the mortar <clears throat> and let our troops take care of the rest well we're probably gonna lose some guys here but it won't be uh, that big a deal <clears throat> so what I did for this to get past Hammerman's level 10 is I got my headquarters to level 6 to get the fourth landing craft I got three of my four landing crafts to level 4 so I could hold uh, two heavies on each uh, boat loaded up two boats with heavies two boats with bazookas uh, the bazookas are incredibly strong offensively but they're incredibly weak defensively the heavies are incredibly uh, strong defensively and moderate offensively but they draw most of the fire they're like giants are in clash of clans so they're fairly powerful meat shields and the bazookas are akin to uh, wizards in Clash of Clans. Powerful attack, but one hit from anything will wipe them out. <clears throat> so you want to deploy your heavies uh, out front. There are faster units, so they're going to take the brunt of the defense's uh, fire. And then your uh, bazookas can, can pick apart the buildings because they're very strong doesn't take long to knock out a building when you're using the bazookas. Damn you! He says he's all pissed off now trying to oppress the people but we freed them. He's moving on to his HQ level 15 or 20, I don't know, whatever's next. Which we will eventually come across and I'll make a video of it when we do. Fireworks going off, we won, yay! <clears throat> yay, we did it. We, did it. Uh, we also got an achievement. So let's go ahead and collect those gems. Uh, early on, the gems are pretty balanced, or I guess they're called crystals in this game. You get a decent amount from achievements. I did spend $5 on the game to support Supercell, because this game is definitely worth $5. I don't know if, I, I don't know if I'll spend any more than that, but definitely worth the $5. War Hero is what we want to strive for here, 300 crystals. For war hero which I'm sure the higher headquarters you get the less uh, uh, 300 crystals will go but all that being said we took out Hammerman's HQ here's a little quick look at the map I can see in the top there there was a resource base there's a, another human player with an exclamation point next to him we'll take him out later uh, as you can see to the right of my headquarters or my base is another resource base you're going to want to try and take over those resource bases if you can, but other human players can steal them from you. Uh, so it's a pretty cool little game. Definitely check it out on the App Store right now. I'll put a link in the description. Until next time, this is Tywin. Peace.